WDTN, the station that's working for you. This is 2 News Today. Good Tuesday morning to you and happy election day. I'm Lauren Wood. So great to have you with us. I'm Zach Pitts. Lauren, I did not put on my smart pants today. Uh -oh. Yes, because I left my jacket in the car. <laughs> and so I ran from the house mm. to the car. It was freezing. I got here and I let Carly know ASAP. Hey, it's cold out just in case you didn't know. And she has much more for you right now. So uh, how long is the cold going to stick around this week? Yeah, it's uh, sticking around for quite some time. I also what else so, did I tell you this morning? Uh, don't do that tomorrow. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> because it's going to be even colder tomorrow. Temperatures will be in the 20s. Thankfully, today we are we're in the upper 30s, so it's not as cold as it could be. 39 degrees at 6 a.m., 37 at 7 a.m., and it'll be 35 degrees around 8 a.m. So we are going to deal with clearing skies. There is a light breeze out there as well. Uh, overall, in our satellite radar imagery, you can see some rain across uh, kind of southeastern Ohio and into northern Kentucky. That's going to stay there. We've got some dry air in place. Shouldn't see much in the way of rain across the Miami Valley. Well, in fact, we're expecting clearing skies. Temperatures right now are in the lower 30s, north of I-70, the upper 30s, south of I-70. And there is a t wind chill out there. So in Dayton, it feels like it's 32 degrees. It feels like it's 30 in Springfield, 31 in Versailles, and 33 at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base. Now here's Katie Kinney with your Time Saver Traffic. 